say Councilman Lee Clark is just an average guy trying to uh, do his best to help lead a town. In this case, we're talking Pilsford, New Jersey, and just trying to do his bit in the world. So nothing too special, but that's how, I, that's how I'd answer it. So I got my start in politics in a way where I just kind of fell into it. I started as a community organizer. Uh, when I was just graduated from college, um, I worked in the environmental sphere. Uh, so it was my job to hold public officials accountable to fight for clean air, clean water, cleaner communities. So from that point, I was out, I was loud, I was active. But at some point, I just wanted to get more involved. So I had done my studies, my bachelor's in political science, um, and then I went to graduate school where I did my master's in business communication. But yeah, I started out as a community organizer and decided to take the next step to public office to represent the people and to help the people the best that I could. Well, what inspired me to get involved in my community, just taking a look around. As I said, I started as a community organizer and it just got to the point where I started getting fed up with the public officials, whether we're talking about the local level or the federal level, where I felt that I could do just as good a job, if not better, because I speak with the people, I want to hear from the people, and I base all my policy decisions with what's going on, whether it's in the neighborhoods, local businesses. So it was just, it came out of a sense of action. And so many people go on social media and complain, but how many people actually get active and do something? So I decided to take a run, uh, first time in 2017. Um, I was, uh, well, 2018, I was 25 years old when I first made my first run for council. Um, and I was elected on my third run at the age of 30, I was sworn in, but I was elected at 29. So I wouldn't know if I'm the youngest or not, but I am the first African American to be elected to our town council. Um, so I do take pride in that, um, only knowing that I'm helping to set a positive appearance. Uh, growing up, uh, we didn't have many people of color in leadership positions, especially in politics, for us to look up to. So I keep that in the back of my head, actually in the front of my head as well, because I know the actions that I'm doing, the things that I'm saying, can create a positive role model or a positive effect for younger kids of color. Um, and it's something that I'm constantly keeping in mind. Also, if I can inspire any of them to go into public service, even one, I think that would be a good day in my book as something that I've inspired someone to do, just as I was inspired to do. Uh, with the election of Barack Obama in 2009, which actually led the way for me to want to go into politics at the earliest form.